This is Lesson 1.7, Three-Dimensional Figures. Your objectives are to identify and name three-dimensional figures and to find surface area and volume. A solid with all flat surfaces is called a polyhedron. The flat surfaces are called faces and they're polygons. The line segments where the faces intersect are edges. The corners where three or more edges meet is a vertex. Polyhedrons can be prisms or pyramids. Prisms have two bases that are wrapped around usually with rectangles. A pyramid has one base and it's wrapped around with triangles. Remember the difference there. Prism with two bases wrapped around with rectangles or some other type of parallelogram. Pyramid has one base wrapped around with triangles. Polyhedrons or polyhedra are named by the shape of their bases. Other solids are a cylinder, which looks like a can, a cone, which is like an ice cream cone, or a sphere, which is like a ball. Notice the solids. The prisms, the pentagonal prism and the rectangular prism, have bases and they're wrapped around with rectangles. The pyramids have bases wrapped with triangles. These three all have curves somewhere, so they're a little bit different from the others. The cylinder, cone, and sphere. Determine whether each solid is a polyhedron, then identify the solid. If it is a polyhedron, name the faces, edges, and vertices. Number one, this has curves, so it's not a polyhedron, but it is a cone. Notice the base is circle S. And it has vertex R. Number two is a sphere. It has curves, so it is not a polyhedron. The sphere has center point T. Number three. This solid has two bases wrapped around with rectangles, so it's a prism. And those bases are pentagons, so it's a pentagonal prism. The faces you first have the two pentagon bases, one of them is PWXYZ and the other one is QRSUV. Then you have the five rectangles. Rectangle WXVQ, PRQW, PZSR, ZYUS, and rectangle YUVX. You also have edges, which are the segments. There's 15 of those. On the left-hand pentagon, you have segment YX, segment XW, segment WP, segment PZ, and segment ZY. Wrapped around the middle, you have five segments, segment YU, segment XV, segment WQ, segment PR, and segment ZS. And on the right hand pentagon you have segment UV, segment VQ, segment QR, segment RS, and segment SU. The vertices are all of the points. There are ten vertices. They are P, W, X, Y, Z on the left, and Q, R, S, U, and V on the right. Just make sure you label everything correctly. The faces are named in order, from one point wrapping around to the end. Edges are segments 
two endpoints with the bar over top, and the vertices are just the capital letter for their point. Number four, this solid has two triangles wrapped around with rectangles, so it is a polyhedron. It's a triangular prism. The faces of the triangular prism start with the two bases. The two bases are triangle ABC and triangle DEF. Then you have the three rectangles that wrap around. Rectangle ABED on the bottom, CBEF, and ADFC. The edges are the segments. There are nine of them. In the first triangle, segment AB, segment BC, and segment AC. Going around the middle, segment BE, segment CF, and segment AD. And in the far triangle, segment DE, segment EF, and segment DF. The vertices are the six points, A, B, C, D, E, and F. Remember again to name everything properly. The triangles have a triangle symbol with the three vertices. The rectangles are just named with the vertices in order as you go around. The edges are segments with the endpoints and a segment bar on top, and the vertices are just the points.